I think there's gonna be a time where like you're gonna lose everything in life kind of like what happened to these people and some asshole like myself is gonna <laughs> is gonna walk all over ugh, walk all over your grave ugh. which well ah, controls which kind of sucks at the same time again Fox Marine don't cur all right so this I think I didn't go here. Wait, I should go somewhere. And I'm still fiddling. <laughs> I'm still fiddling with the controls. Sorry about that, folks. All right. So number one is um, let's explore this side because I remember going through here. Let's pick this up, and we got another puzzle piece. I like the hype. I like the hype behind these puzzle pieces, and we're gonna find out soon what it's uh what it's about. Like, what are these for? Since uh, Alexia gave us one, she took one from uh from the empty from the empty chest a while ago. So we're gonna let's pray. Let's pray to Jihan. Right, let's do that. Not exactly. Okay, well, we're not exactly praying. Alright. Now, I don't know why there is a G there on that, um, on whatever we stepped on. So, we're here in the house of Jihan. Let's talk to this kid. What do you got to say? Master Jihan wants to have a word with you. Alright. And this is nothing. It's just a little training dummy that we got here. Omega said you'd be coming. Who's Omega? Your father was a great warrior and a friend. My name's Jihan. The palace wizard used his magic to lock me in here. The only way to break the spell is by finishing all four puzzle pieces. Do you have any? I think I do. Do I have any? I don't forgot how many. Each time I, I complete a puzzle, I'll teach you a new combo attack. Do you have any puzzle pieces right now? I have one. I have three. Wonderful. Excellent. I still need three more puzzle pieces to finish this puzzle, so I need six in total. Okay. So we're not we're not getting anything from Jihan. But alright. I guess there's nothing else to see here in this town, so let's go back to Alexi and see what else what else she has to complain about. What do you have to say? They said it was a giant bull from Mithra that bombed us. It had a pirate symbol on it. They must have heard that you were here. I shouldn't have let you into our house. Hey, 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 hey lady, it's not, not my fault. <laughs> Alright, let's go here. Okay, Alexi, what do you want? Pirates must have found out you were here. They wanted to destroy you with the village. We're going to have them. We're going to find them. Ugh, and make them pay for all of this. Mithra Valley is over by the city of Toroletto. Let's head to the city first. Alright. All right. should just leave you there. You left without me before. But before we go to um, the next area, I... I missed something in the forest earlier. I don't know if like this item that I missed has any bearing in the long run, but I feel like Oh no, you won't let me go. Let's, there's no time. No time no waste, let's go. Right. Yeah, fine, whatever. Just let me do what I, what I wanna do and get, get go past these monkeys with underwear. Nope, oh, missed. Whiffed on that one. Fantastic. I'll just carry this. 
Oh, no, no, no. No, why did I whiff on that one? Fantastic. Great start. A great start to this recording session. I'm gonna go back here. Since we have... There's no old man to help us out. There we go. Oh, wait. Oh, I did get the compass. Oh, I'm a dumbass. All right. Um, yeah, I think I wasted like a minute or two of your time. And none of this happened. And I guess we're here. We're right on time here on Tortuga Beach. Alexia says, The thought of them bombing such an innocent village makes me so mad. Let's go, Flint. And leave me again. Oh, ladies first, I guess. Got him. Right, fly. Fly. Damn it. Alright. I'll just take him out just to sort of secure this area. So I don't have to worry about anything else. And we have a treasure. <laughs> I can speak well. I have a- we have a treasure chest here, so let's open it up. Okay, it's nothing. Wait, do I have a limit on how much, uh... Cannot help hold- <laughs> I can't hold anymore, so 9 is the max? Alright, that's a little strange. Ooh. Platforming with really strange controls. Alright, so we got this beach right here. Damn it, bird. No. Turn around, I'm just gonna bait him to attack. And that should be it. Uh, I think for this one, there is no way for me to get this just yet. So I'll have to, have to run back for that one. I think there's a skill or something. Come on. Damn it, bird. There's a skill or an item that I might need for that one, so I'm just gonna bait this fucking bird back here. Get my chicken out of here. Get here, bitch. There you go. Alright, so that's a dart. I'm not sure if I explained it earlier, but yeah, darts are... They, like, help you to a minigame. I didn't even counter. I'm not sure if I'm gonna encounter it in the next town coming up. As I said, like... I didn't, um... I did put a lot of time into this as a dumb kid. Okay. We got another chest here, let's see. And coin! Alright, we got coin. But for the life of me, I couldn't remember exactly how I went about things. And me being a dumb, shitty kid. Like, I probably skipped a lot of, um, I probably skipped a lot of, uh, cutscenes and mechanics, probably a lot like this, but what I like about this game, right, is that, damn it, I have to go back, no, I don't have to go back, alright, um, this game just shows you what you need to do. I'll, I'll clear this area first, see if we can break that off. That cube over there, and get up. No. Take you out. Damn it, thanks. I'm gonna need that, damn it. No, no. No. All right, that was, that was really, uh, I truly fumbled that one. Yeah, let's just heal up. I don't think that bird is gonna come down anytime soon. All right, never mind. I spoke. I spoke too soon. No, okay, never mind then. All right, I'll see if I can. Another herb. Yeah. All right. That's fine. That's fine. Herbs are fine. Just don't want to get to 
I don't want to get into it with this bird, so I want to take it out. There you go. Bastard. So this is a bit like a... I guess this is one of the areas in the game that's a little bit like a maze. And so far, like, this first area is, I guess, okay. I mean... This area has you move, like, asking you to move the camera a bit. Alright. Since... Can I break this? No, I cannot. Let's see if I could, uh... No, I think I'm gonna need something to burn that bomb on top of it. So, it looks like that's another thing I have to come back for. Fox Marine, wasting your time again for... In increments of two minutes each. That's fine. That's fine. We're making progress, folks. So I'll, you know, I, I make, I may take the occasional detour. Detours like figuring out which camera, which camera suits me best. Yeah, all right. This is another. Let's see. I think this is another puzzle. Or I mean. Whatever resembles a puzzle for this game is well. It's it, this game just shows you how to solve it sometimes, and then like, I guess for the more advanced, uh, for the more advanced stages, like me missing this, me missing that water jar. I was supposed to throw it at that statue over there. Nope, damn it. All right. <laughs> All right. Do it again. Do it again. Third time's the charm. No, of, or of course I'd, of course I'd miss that one. Of course, stupid me. All right. Okay. <laughs> oh, damn it. <laughs> Ah, all right, and there's a coin that I just missed. I'm off to a good start today, huh? There you go. I don't think I should. I didn't. I didn't have to be that far off. I could have been as close, as close to it as possible. We're gonna do this again since there are another. There's another set of statues here. I'm, I'm not gonna take it. I'm not gonna take any chances with this. I'm just gonna throw it right there. There we go. So the mazes here, they're okay so far. Here's another part of the maze, and I've been through here earlier. And one of the things that irks me is that if you're gonna design a maze, especially like as a game designer because while I did make my own games I did it I wouldn't consider myself as a game designer but looking at this like this is has nothing there's nothing here for me to interact with so what's the point it's not exactly a hiding spot there's no threats on either side so there's no point to this and this really irks me since I think I, I did mention, like, for my graduate thesis, I made my own game, and why can't I not clear this jump? Why am I not clearing it? <laughs> Wait, well, my timing's off. So, yeah, um, I did make my own game at one point, and it's a short game. It's like four levels. It's a, it's a JRPG. Okay, now all that for something I can't use. But it was a JRPG, and it had like four levels to it. And one of those levels was a jungle level, which was... I hope I can pull it out so I can show you at one corner... What cor at the corner of this video, and I can show you, in, show you guys in post. If I can't, I'll just try my best to describe it to you guys. But basically, it's a, it's a jungle where the first... It's a big jungle. It's big enough for, I don't know, like 20 screens. Um... Normally, RPG Maker has a resolution of 800 by 600. If if I can, if that's um, if my memory serves me well, and right. 
solve that one. So, all right, I'm gonna go down here. And so, like, when you're um, the whole map is much bigger than 800 by 600 resolution. So it's like 20 of those, like multiply that times 20. And basically the whole jungle itself, can I jump up here? Yeah, there's, there are enemies here. So the whole, the whole, the whole uh, jungle, the whole map, I'm sorry, is, um, it's, for the first, like, first part of it, you go across, you go, like, the entire length of the map, and at some point, you end, you hit a, um, you hit a fork in the road, and this is the, basically the only part in the map that gives you, you know, like, a choice, like, you go to the left or to the right, it's that simple. Now if you went to what I remember the right, if you go to the right, it goes to your objective. There's no other, um, there's no other splits in the path and it, I hope that that pig didn't drop anything, but it goes directly to the, to your objective for that particular map, but it's long, it goes it goes zigzag. It, it it cover. It's just. I'll admit, when I designed it, I just wanted to um, extend the gameplay. But that's on me. But for the if you go left, it'll lead you to a dead end where there's just where there where where, <laughs> where there's a treasure chest involved. So at least like hey, I'm rewarding the player. Now was a, I was being a little bit of um. I guess I'm being a snarky asshole with what I did next is that if you selected the treasure chest again like the character will open up dialogue saying like hey there's something weird in here and if you um you selected it again actually that that chest is covers up a uh, covers up a hole looks like we uh, got something here it covers up a shortcut that leads you directly to your objective. So the thing is like this alternate path rewards you and it rewards players who decide to to what's the term to explore to explore a little bit more. Those do not look like ducks. So I like it when when mazes are there's intent. There's intent when uh, intent in their designs like catching you so I caught him so I don't know I'm just mindful of them so I, I do geek out like I do geek, geek out over like really good mazes like the one in RE4 that's another yeah where uh, where you fight dogs only the way that's a really good example of like map design uh, maze design and like you seem to be having a problem here, miss. Oh, we're playing we're playing the sweet music now. What do you want? What do you have to say? I thought you'd never come. Why are you always so slow? Toriletto isn't that far away, let's hurry. Yeah, yeah, sure. Okay. You know what? Yeah, fine. Let's just get this over with. You've insulted me about my height. Yeah. So, uh, you're lucky I'm a bit more patient this time around, Alexia. Yeah, let's go. Let's go to Toledo. Hmm, I honestly think, like, I think I just stumbled. I stumbled again in with my words this time around. So, there is an in here. Can I swing my sword? I cannot. So, let's save here and this end before I start exploring again. Alright. Hey, what's, what's your problem? Gamer is bad on the bullfights too. Absolutely! <laughs> let's do that. <laughs> let's do that instead. Yep. I figured. So are you going to watch the going to the next match? Yeah, alright. Yeah, let's do that too. Of course. 
you come to this town, you gotta see the fights. I will do that. It's 10 gold per night, let's save. Uh, this is a nice hustle you got. If you want to save your progress, you gotta pay. Then again, like 10 gold isn't that expensive in this part of the game, so whatever. Let's rotate our saves again. See, I saved in Toroledo. Is it Toroledo or Toroledo? Eh. Either way, I, I'm totally fucking up how how that is supposed to be pronounced. Herc kids, do you have anything interesting to say, kids? Alright. Come on, come on, you're supposed to. You're supposed to take. Nope, I don't. Okay, yeah, looks like. Let's take that to the Bull King Arena. Maybe that'll cheer him up. Alright, well, what happened to you? His favorite, Lao, is gone. Who is Lao? Yeah, same thing. Alright. Is Lao his favorite child that he lost? <laughs> uh. Alright, is Alexia still here? Does she have anything to say? I feel a lot better now. Oh, good, <laughs> we're going bullfighting. Hey you, you made it to the end of the video. Good job! Well, a better job than what I've been doing. If you'd like more disappointment, check out these links. This is a warning, not a guarantee.